Now we're going to get into some more Halloween, you guys. Um, I promised I was not buying anymore, and I did. Um, I finally, finally found these. Now, this is after everybody else had hauled these, okay? These, um, like, what are these, like, um, Halloween gumball machines or just fall gumball machines because this is just a pumpkin shape. Um, I bought one for my sister and I bought one for myself. I don't know what I'm going to put in here. My sister did, I, uh, she had some of the, um, the gumballs that look like eyeballs. Now, we know that they won't come out the other end because they're too big. But just to make them kind of spooky, we put the gumball, the eyeball gumballs in here. Um, and it was really, really cute. So I don't know what I'm going to put in here. I may just put some lights in here, you guys. I don't know. We'll see. But I was so excited to find it after I had been looking for these forever. Okay, I hope you picked up some lights. These are the LED tea light candles. And this is just to go around our decor that we have for Halloween. So we picked them up in black. And we picked them up in orange. Um, I picked these up. I saw somebody haul these and I thought they were pretty neat. This is Spooky Selfies, four mini pops, individually wrapped. These are the lip pops, lollipops. And um, it, these are the lip pops. I think they look like fangs or something. They're like fangs, lips, fangs, different lips. These are the green apple lollipops. It says, press, dress up as your favorite monster. So I guess you would use them, um, you know, as being a monster. Pretty cool. Doesn't say too much. You get four of them. And that's what we picked up. We thought these would be really cute. Uh -uh, hubby said he may even wear these to work. We'll see if he really does it. So I picked up two packs of those. My husband and my children, I eat them, but they're not my favorite. My favorite is Snickers. My husband and my children love Reese's, the miniature cups. So we picked this bag up. And I finally, finally, finally found the Cowtails Minis, the Caramel Apple. I kept running across the Cowtails, but not the Caramel Apple ones. And I wanted the Caramel Apple so bad, so I finally found them. Um, I bought two bags of these. I gave my sister a bag. Um, now, she was saying this would be really neat to take and melt them down and um, dip your apples in them. Which I didn't even think, but then I looked at the picture and I'm like, oh my, I could do that. So, um, you know, that would be something great for people to do if they want to do, or you can just eat them like they are. One, two other, let me see, two last Halloween things. My husband convinced me to buy this, you guys. These are the Just Pretending Glow in the Dark Masks. He thought this would be pretty cool because we usually wait in our garage for the kids to come trick or treat. So we were thinking, oh, we might put a mask on. And these are pretty simple. You know, this is the Jason, you know, Jason, whatever mask. And it, they glow in the dark. So that's one. He's going to do that one. And then mine was just a skeleton. Hopefully they fit our faces. We thought that would be pretty neat to scare the kids. Um, let's see. Onward to the toy aisle, you guys, okay? <clears throat> now, I also, if you did not know, collect like home decor, like Ray Dunn um, mugs and Ray Dunn items. But Ray Dunn has a line that came out for Monsters, Inc. So I like to put my mugs out and then I like to dress them up a little bit with different things. So I found all of the Monsters, Inc. to go with my decor. So here is, oh God, what is his name, you guys? Randall. Okay. And here is... Mike Wazowski. Here is Sully. I already have something of Sully, but I thought that was pretty neat. And I think that's it, you guys, that I have of them. Oh, no. And here's Boo. They also have Boo. I'm so excited. Yes, yes, yes. So I'm going to put all those up with my decor. Um, I Then my daughter loves 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 you guys and she's 26 years or well, 25 years old um she loves spongebob she has loved him forever so i'm gonna probably stick these in her stockings or something like that so i picked up spongebob and i picked up patrick they had spongebob and patrick 
Okay, now we're gonna move on to some other items I picked up. I saw somebody hauling this just the other day. These are the car coasters. Matter of fact, it was Twisted Gypsy. She was hauling these and I was like, I have got to have them. These are the car coasters. They fit into your um, cup holders in your car. Oh, I love this idea. Keep your um, cup holders from getting dirty, keep them from getting wet. Wonderful. So I picked up one, two of the car coasters just for me and hubby. Um, one had the pineapple on it and one had the rainbow. They had others, but these were the two I picked up. Um, she also hauled these car hooks. She also hauled these car hooks, which I thought were just wonderful. This was the only one left in the store, you guys. Excuse me, you put it right there, babe. Hubby is bringing me a glass of wine, which is much needed. Um, it is, I think I hauled it the other day, you guys, but it is the Bordy Vineyards. This is the Riesling. So I need this. I'm so tired, you guys. Anyway, um, <clears throat> she hauled the, Twisted Gypsy uh, hauled the car hooks. And these are to hook in your car so you can hang your purses, hang your bags, do whatever you need to do. Um, so I picked these up. These were the last ones in the store. Okay, so that means people are truly buying them. Then I picked up, this was the smartphone LED selfie light. And I do film with my phone in case you guys didn't know. So I'm thinking this would be great. So we're gonna see how this works out. I picked it up in the pink. They had it in all different colors. Um, I have been having problems, you guys, with my wrist. I think I have carpal tunnel because I type all day long, you guys, with my job. So I picked this up to try to get my wrist back in shape. Um, and we hope this works. So I picked that up. Um, I had, I love this. My daughter the other day, she'd been walking in some shoes. I think they rubbed her feet wrong. She had some blisters. So she grabbed my Cured pack and she was so excited about it because it had different sizes and it had the alcohol wipe in it. I just think these first aid packs are just great from Dollar Tree. Um, so I went out and picked the, picked up another pack for her. So pick that up. <clears throat> I also picked up this. Um, this is the Absorbing Plus Ultra Strength Pain Relief Patch for shoulders, arms, neck, and legs. Relieves sore muscles and arthritis pain, deep penetrating, no mess, comfortable, breathable, and stays on secure. I didn't know whether I would need this because my pain for my wrist, you guys, is like up my arm. So I was going to try to use this um, for that. So I don't know whether I'm going to end up using this or not, but it'll be great just to have it on hand in case we need it. Oh, I do need something to drink. Hold on, you guys. Oh, it's getting very, very parched. Oh my God, that Riesling. Bomb. So now we're going to get into Christmas, you guys, okay? I'm steady buying Christmas, steady buying Christmas. Now my theme for Christmas, you guys, is going to be Winter Wonderland. So I saw, um, oh my goodness. Oh, I can't think of her name. I saw someone haul these the other day, um, and I thought they were gorgeous. So I went in the store and saw them and I had to have them for my winter wonderland theme. So I picked these up, two of them. And then I saw more ornaments. Now I showed you guys that I found some African-American ornaments at Dollar Tree and they normally do have very good representation. Um, I found these, so I picked this one up, gorgeous. I found Santa. Now this is ceramic and breakable, but I loved it, so I picked him up. This one is also ceramic and breakable. Santa is skating. Loved it. Picked it up. This is ceramic too, you guys. So all of these were ceramics. Um, I had already picked up some other ones, and they were, I think they might, those were ceramic also. Now, I ran across these. Um, these are stickers, which I intend to use. These are so cute. Look at all the different ones, you guys. I'm going to use these in my DIYs. These are the Crafters Square, and you get 11 pieces. Love it. Look at, it. Look at this, this is so cute. So I picked those up. <clears throat> Here's another set. This is 14 pieces. So look at that one. Oh, you get the deer. Oh, this is, these are really, really cute. So I picked that one up. <clears throat> and here's another one. 
this one gave you 11 pieces. And these are all different. All three are different. I made sure I looked through so I could get some different ones. Really, really cute, you guys. So I, all that is Christmas. That's all I picked up. Well, I picked up a little bit more for Christmas. That's about it for that. Then I was searching and searching, you guys, for this mug. I had seen people hauling it. I wanted it. I finally found it in Delaware. Um, this says hot cocoa served here. It has a picture of the cocoa mug, which I love. It has the red on the handle. I'm going to use this in my um, coffee bar. So I love that. I got two of these. Then I had to pick up the snowman. This is so cute and darling. And then this mug is even bigger. This is really wide. I would love this to drink my tea or coffee out of, or my hot cocoa. So I picked up two of these. I probably will share with my sister. So that is the end of basically the Christmas items. Then let's move on to the last items. I think are like cleaning and household. Um, Let's see, I picked these up. These are the Clean Life Double Action Cleansing, Cleaning Cloth. Clean Life Scrubbing Clean, Double Action Cleaning Cloth. Pet fabric cleans on one side and scrub scratch free on the other side. Use wet or dry, size 12 by 12, and it's machine washable. So you can wash these, I guess, and use them again. And you get two cloths. So I picked that up. Then, Oh, let me sit down, you guys. I'm tired today. We did a lot of shopping. Um, <clears throat> I picked up the Jot Sticky Notes, and there's 100 sheets. Now, I like the bigger ones, so this was pretty cool with me, so I picked these up in pink. My husband likes a spiral notebook, so he picked this up. This is by Jot. Um, this is a 100 sheets steno book. He likes to take notes like in something like this, so he picked that up. Then, you guys, which you guys know I always go slightly crazy, I started looking at the pens. Now, I kept thinking of them as stocking stuffers, but I fell in love with a lot of them myself, so I may be keeping them. Um, these are, let's see, it says Z-Grip um, Meat Zen Skin, the coat on the back, I don't know what that is. Black ink, 1.0 millimeter, medium point. Look at these, these are so cute. Ballpoint pen. Look at that, you guys. I love these. Love them. So I had to get it. It's a pack of two. Um, and I will be using some of these as stocking stuffers, you guys. Um, this is the Journalizing Ink Metallic Brush Marker. Premium metallic finish writes on black paper. Look at the green. Look at the brush point, you guys. Oh, yeah. I love that green. <clears throat> now, this one I really loved for myself. I don't think I'm going to give this one away. This is the Ink Dual FX, two colors in one, 3D effect, perfect for doodling, 3D, you guys. So it says double tip makes 3D effects, two double tip markers. What? I love this. I think I'll be keeping them for myself. Here's another one, the metallic brush. Um, this one is in silver ink. <clears throat> here is this is just a basic ballpoint pen zebra i thought it wrote in i don't know i thought it wrote in pink but i'm not sure the pen might just be pink but i thought that was cute stocking stuffer and then these are they had sharpies they had every color of the sharpie this is the mystic gems um and it says marks on most surfaces this one is like a peachy pink. Fine permanent marker. Yes, I love Sharpies. Here's a micro tip brush pen. And this one's in black. Here's another pink Sharpie, you guys. Some regular pens. These are just gel pens. I just thought they were cute, had cute designs. Another smoothie, um, smoothie, huh? Another Sharpie, you guys, in orange. These were so cute. These are erasers, and these are by Jot. You get four. Look at these erasers, you guys. Oh, my God. I'll, I'll be giving these to the kids, but they are so cute. Look at that. Oh, my God, they're little monsters. These are adorable, okay? 
So I picked these up. I'll be giving these. I'll be donating these. But these are so cute. I'll probably be donating a lot of the pens too. Um, now, I saw people hauling these. So I wanted to show these. Um, they had these in the Dollar Tree. Um, these are the Scrubbing Bubbles. Um, bathroom cleaner, foaming bleach, erases mold and mildew stains. These are the 32 fluid ounces. These are basically, um, I think these are the refills because they don't have the spray tops, but you just have to have the spray top if you want to spray it. Um, this is a great deal for $1.25. Even the cashier at the Dollar Tree said so. So I picked up <clears throat> two of these. Had to have that. Um, hubby saw that they had um, this is furniture polish. It's cream furniture polish. Lemon cream. Cleans, protects, and shines. Yeah, I need to polish a lot, you guys, with all these decor items I have. So I picked that up. And then um, my brother-in-law, who cleans all the time, you guys, he is a cleaner. Um, my sister's husband. This is LA's Totally Awesome Foaming Bathroom Cleaner with Bleach. He says this is the best, you guys, okay, for cleaning. Removes soap, scum, dirt, and tough stains. Um, cleans and deodorizes. So I went ahead and purchased this. This is a pretty big bottle. It has 32 fluid ounces. He said it is great. So I'm going to try this. And then he said the Comet was great. This is the Comet foam bath cleaner with bleach. Removes dirt and soap scum buildup. These are great for my shower because I'm always, always, and I know everybody knows the problem of getting the soap scum out of your shower, making it look pretty and clean and sparkly. Um, and your toilet bowls. So I'm hoping that these will work for me. Okay, now onward, you guys. Hubby picked these up. These are removable hooks and holds up to three pounds. These are just like the regular, you know, the hooks, the hooks. But these look like wood. I've never seen these kind. Hubby picked these up. You get two in a pack. And he picked up another pack. And the last items we have, you guys, um, in our last haul, we picked up the Glad Quick Tie Heavy Duty bags. They were with Gain and Febreze. So these are for 30-gallon bags. They're large trash quick tie bags. And you got a bonus. Instead of getting four, you got six. So we picked up two in the last haul, and hubby picked up two more. So that is it, you guys. We have purchased everything. This will be my last haul for Dollar Tree for a while because I don't need anything. I have purchased everything. Um, yeah, this is about it, you guys. So it'll be a while till I see people hauling things that I don't have. Um, I am still looking for the Yardley hand soap. If anybody wants to send it to me, um, you can DM me on Lady C Queen Foodie on Instagram. Ask me for my address and I will gladly give it to you if you're going to send them to me. Um, if you would like to tell me where I can find them, I live in Maryland. Um, I will go as far as Delaware. Um, so, you know, I will go to Maryland, Delaware, or possibly Pennsylvania, uh, certain parts of Pennsylvania, uh, to find them. So let me know if you see them, and I'll be on the lookout. You guys, stay safe, stay blessed. Have a great weekend. I love you all for all your support. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It's very important to the channel to keep Lady C going. I just love y'all. I can't say how much, but I've got to go and chill out. I am so tired from shopping, hauling, videoing, editing. It's a lot of work, you guys. Talk at you later. Bye-bye now. Ooh, hubby put out the lights, you guys. You probably can't see it, but that's a little ghost. And they're all little Halloween things out here. He has lit up everything, you guys. We got our Halloween decor out here. And it looks really, really cute. We're trying to get it together to be spooky for the kids, y'all.